Welcome to the Super Chevy Brothers Podcast. This is your host, Trevor. Uh, this is episode 63, and we're joined by a uh, special guest today. 21, 21. 21. I'm sorry, what? Hey, yo, you know what it is? Scrape, scrape shit. It's your boy, 21 Savage. All right. We, <laughs> we are joined by... Uh, 21, 21. Your boy, 21 Savage. You know what I'm saying? Here, I want the kids to save any money, you know, straight up. Got my cup full of unknown substance doing what I do. Uh, is that a penis tattooed on your forehead? It's a knife, you bitch ass niggas. I'm tired of y'all asking the same question every time I do an interview. I told y'all this in 2017. Okay. Uh, well, this is Super Chevy Brothers Podcast. We have another guest today, 21 Savage. <sighs> Uh, how how's your, your week interviews. been? Twenty one. It's it's it was what? good. It was good until you said I had showed on my forehead, bro. I don't appreciate that. I'm getting gang slaughtered on you, dick. I don't. It I don't does kind of look that. like a penis. It don't look like. A dick, it, but I, I appreciate if you, thought, from a five. if you said it was a knife. You know, I'm a godly ass nigga. You know what I mean? I would accept that. You know what I mean? I don't, I don't. I don't appreciate none of that shit. And what is Yo, that in your hand? Yo, pause. I it's, see. I, I see. You're holding your microphone like a. Like a teacup, and you have eight styrofoam cups stacked up in the other hand. What's that? I got the double cup. You know what I mean. That looks like more than two. It was an extra stressful day. So, I, can you explain why you stacked the cups, um, Mister Savage? Well, you see, the way the science works is, if it's in my cup, it's in my cup. Leave me alone. Like my like my idol said. You ain't ever listened to Lil Wayne before. No, I've I've I'm a fan of Lil Wayne. Uh, but okay, all right. Thanks for your your cup. Is your cup? Is your cup? Uh, are you not hot? Uh, where are you? Are you in? I mean, are you in Biko's home? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I tied him up. He in the other room right now. I I just told him I'm gonna record this podcast real quick. So he didn't invite you to the show. You, you like, you've got him on ransom. Or yeah, something? yeah, yeah. No, you, no. I'm, you want something from him? I'm out here seeing my Houston homies. You know what I'm saying? He just, he, he happened to be the lick the day. You know what I mean? So I'm catching him rolling around in his little dumpy ass car, and you know I got his ass. You know what I mean? So I'm just recording the pod. I'm gonna let him go after this. He seemed like a nice guy. Um, you know, I ain't take too much from him, but I needed somewhere to stay. So he's he, he's well, he's welcome just to the show right now. Okay, he's tied up. All right. Well, welcome to the show. This is a video games podcast. That's I'm letting you and the audience know uh, what that is. That's uh, what this and shit we is. are in the throat. What? That's what this shit is. I played 2K before. I, I, I dig that shit. Hey, you know, I got. A, right. I did a we song know. for. I did a song for that uh, Mortal Kombat game. Right, and yeah. as we all know, most most black people play games, only play sports games and or fighting games. So. I'm sure you'll you be you fine. Play, do topics. you not play sports or fighting games? Is that not what people play I, these days? I I I I do, but um, I I think I play a whole gamut of games. Uh, how about you? Any games you play, Mr. Yeah, yeah, Savage? You know what I mean, yeah, you know, when I, when I get you know, when I get a chance. You know, it's been kind of quiet recently. You know, I've been, I've been, I've been doing what I can. I play some 2K. You know, I I, I got into Dark Souls. That shit was hard though. So I played this game called uh, my homie put it on me on. It's called Mortal Shell. That shit was easy, bro. That shit was trash, but you know it was good. It was, you know, wasted enough time between you know the next person I had to murder. You know, so this is what it is though. Okay, all right. Um, well, this is a show. Uh, I this week or the earlier this week, I played. Uh, Ghost of Tsushima Legends. Oh, and man, that is that shit. a fun game? Oh, it's good. It, it's it is. Good. It brings me back to my Gears days of, of multiplayer fun. It, it's a, uh, you know, it's classic. Not classic. It's 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 multiplayer fun. I love it. It's so fun. It's uh, I got together with. 21, 21. Well, I did two things actually. I played Neo. 20, I beat 21. the first and second DLC all in the, the same. Oh shit! There, there are day. two of them. The last bit of the first and the entire the second DLC, all within the, yeah, I think it was Sunday morning, and um, that was fun. I mean, Neo's fun. The combat's great. It, you know, it doesn't have the depth and the 
you know the production maybe that other stuff does yeah. but i had a great time uh slee stack and i ran through that and uh the story is still gibberish i mean it's there it makes sense uh, but it's still all pointless and worthless uh because you know at the end of the day nothing changes it's gonna be the same shit it was so what they, what so, they, what they it was fun with the dlc i don't know what's the dlc oh okay so I'm, i i'm probably gonna stick another hundred hours into uh neo because they finally added this to the game and now you can just solely be like a fucking street fighter you can just be you can just beat people up yeah, exactly. Oh, you, you can. It, it's so fun. I'm gonna have to the thing is, that. I have I don't have a build for it. I've got a magic and skill build, and I was hoping you know it would be more leaning on skill that weapon, but you know, fuck me, it's not. So, um, damn, I'm, I'll probably have to make another build or just grind up another ninety nine points. Damn, into... you, got, you got to beat the whole game again to make another build. No, you don't have to, but it co- it does cost you a million dollars. So that's a thing to always consider. Oh, uh, but I, I'm going to go back in there. There's, I think there are two more new game pluses I've got to finish now, which shouldn't be a problem because I did the DLC. And if it's like the first game, when you do the DLC for one uh, new game, mm-hmm. it actually opens up the entirety of the next new game because the 20, dlc 20. is supposed to be harder than the base of the next next new game or whatever yeah so i should have them open if that's not the case and i just have to play through it again but um neo like dark souls well actually neo is not like dark souls in dark souls once you beat it the second time the third and fourth and fifth, it's not that much harder at all. It's, it's actually yeah. easier and easier because you just keep like that's blasting what, your what levels Brad up. Told me. Yeah. Before I beat his ass. That's that too. Oh! Why would you sneak in the room and not tell me that you're in the room? I thought you could tell. I was looking to see what Vico. How would I know that you're in the room? Okay. And you're sitting behind me. I thought I thought you I thought you got like murdered or something. Jesus Christ. Bye. I'm sorry. Oh, it's his character. The rapper, Twenty One Savage. Go look it up on Google. Okay. Yeah, you... <laughs> you know embarrassing that is. <laughs> We're not gonna put it in the video. It's fine. <laughs> All right, so I look to my left, and to my left is our mother, or sorry, my mother and Cheval's mother, in yeah, in like a too. huddle position, hands on knees, bent over, squinting, like a meter away from me, right <laughs> here. <laughs> she didn't say a word. She just walked in. And she's staring at the screen trying to figure out who you are. And then she made me squeal like a little woman. Jesus. Oh, God. Hey, man, it's like that sometimes. Hey, yo. Um, you, mind if yeah. I, you mind if I bring Biko in here real quick? He want to... He wanna, uh, no. Want, no? Okay. Okay, I'll leave him tied. What did he want to say? I thought he's tied up in the back like Drake. <sighs> You know, I'm a little lenient. He told me I could record the podcast. I wanted to, you know, I want to see if I could uh, get his opinion on something. He was telling me he was, uh, that, that the PlayStation box was at Burger King. I don't know what that means. I don't know if he was blacking out or something. But yeah, that's yeah, what play, he told me. Burger King had the PlayStation giveaway. Yeah, so, um, yeah. which I still haven't gotten a PlayStation yet. So I'll probably be buying a lot of Whoppers over the next. Two or three weeks, Damn, and bro. just don't, you know what? The best whopper is a cold whopper. I'll tell you that. Take a whopper. Know, take bro. a whopper. Go to Burger King. One. Savage, check this out. So you got a lot of money, right? Yeah, bro. But I like them faux for foes. I don't. I don't know about them Burger King shit, bro. Uh, 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 uh what? For faux for foes. Faux for foe. The faux for foe. What's a faux for foe? 
At Wendy's, bro, you get the you get the drink, you get the burger, you get the fries, you get the nuggets, Ooh. you get the fo fo fo. All right. Well, at Burger King, fo, if you fo, want fo, a PlayStation twenty one, it's great up. Well, Wendy's isn't giving away the PlayStation five. So, uh, if you want a PlayStation five at Burger King, you go to Burger King, you get the two for five deal. You get either two whoppers or two of something, and you get. Yeah, for five dollars, and I guess you get to enter for the PlayStation. Anyway, Neo, great. Ghost of Tsushima Legends is super fun. It's like it's the same fun that I have in Avengers, except the matchmaking works. <laughs> so uh, okay. that's that's, that big, game was that's trash. a big plus. When I when I when I bust well, up the game is nigga, trash. Av- bust Avengers house, is actually he was yelling at it. He was yelling at Avengers because because Iron Man was just staring at a table. I don't know what happened after after I, I shot the screen, but I mean, he seemed pretty mad oh, at that game. You're you're a gun toter, huh? You're Republican. You're wearing red. No, nah, I don't wear. I don't. I don't, don't fuck with no Republican. You did. I don't do none of that. I like my guns, though. Right. I like guns. So you're a Republican. You can't like guns and not. Nah, be a bro. I don't fuck with no Republicans. I just like my guns, bro. I didn't say they registered. Okay. Republicans so anyway, um, don't do that shit. Uh, Twenty one. You are very rude. You interrupt me a lot. You know that, nigga. You getting the free Twenty one in that savage interview? Leave me alone. Okay. Yeah. 20, I heard you're from England, actually. Where's your accent? I ain't got no fucking accent. I grew up in Atlanta, Zone Six. But you were born and you 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 grew up a good deal of your life in England. And where's your where's your accent? And nigga, if I, I was gotta born feel in, like you're posing. All right, let me put Are it. Th- let me let me let me put it this way. Let me put it this way. If a nigga born in Zimbabwe, right, and he leaves mm-hmm. Zimbabwe when he's three years old, and he get to Zone Six Atlanta, is he gonna sound mm-hmm. like a nigga from Zimbabwe? Or he gonna sound like a dude. He from gonna Zone sound 6? the Zimbabwe. I mean, what do you mean? Of course. I don't that know, man. Good. A lot of people be getting on me for my music, but you just racist. I don't know about that, man. Straight up. Oh, what's the viscosity of whatever's in your cup? Because you've been drinking it quite a bit, and it still, it, it still seems to be uh, to have the liquid in it. Nigga, it, what what do you think it is? You listen to rap. Hey, be careful with the N word, okay? This show is listened to mostly by lighter skinned individuals, so So the word I, doesn't I, apply I, to them? It does, but okay. Anyway. Wow, you light skin anyway. you light skinned fools on another whole other planet. Wow. Alright, anyway. Uh, Legends is great. It's a great team. Uh I put in like three hours yesterday. I went from level I think I was like seventeen or fifteen or something. Uh, to power level forty five, something like that. Uh, it's the the one thing is, it, the game gives you a lot of freedom in classes, which is good and bad because people don't have incentives. How much? How many to, hours you played? You think? Uh, including on Sunday, it uh, it's probably like set six or seven hours. Ooh, now. damn! Yeah. But we did multiplayer on Sunday, and we failed, I think, 10 times. We didn't beat a single level. Damn. And then we beat the very last one. We did one more, and we we did it. I mean, straight up. we beat it at the end. So, And that then yesterday cool. I got in, and I figured out more of what to do. And I, I probably finished, like, I finished the entirety of the story mode. And then maybe four, hey, four or five. You beat, the, you beat the single player yet? Nah, mm, nah. Mm. Mm, you taking kind of long. I beat that. I beat that game. That's a good game. I like that game. Sushi, I thought you only played was a good game. Nah, bro. I'm not. I'm, but I'm all about the PlayStation shit, bro. I love PlayStation game. I love. What's it? It's PlayStation exclusive. I like them, bro. That's my all shit. All right, twenty one. All right, twenty one. Two K. If two K was a it was an exclusive, I think PlayStation would win this generation. Well, this is a uh, game podcast, but today we have a lot of PlayStation news, so let's, let's go ahead and get into it. Okay. Uh, Sony Ooh. announced that they're going to... Before that, actually, you hear about all the Twitch 
uh, DMCA's Twitch is dropping lots of DMCA's on thousands of creators for music, not just music people play alongside the game, but music actually in the game. Mm-hmm. And they've gotten strikes. Yep. This happened a few weeks back, but now like uh, they hit a large, large portion of people, and those videos were all deleted. So straight up, all of those videos that had a strike before are gone. 21, lots 21. of straight, content straight. gone. And people aren't liking it because I don't like this shit. You're gonna stream a game, you really don't have that much control over what music's in there, no control, what's happening. Bitch. Uh the companies actually want you to stream the game. Stream, they pay for stream. some streams, they rely on streams for like Genshin Capital, Impact, Genshin. for example, relies on streams for, you know, Money. spreading Money. the word, getting people out. Is that do is do you just ad lib while you <laughs> All day? Is that what you do? Yeah, you man. Yeah, you, know, you know, I did. I, I, you don't like that? You don't, you want me to stop? I mean, no, know, I no, just, no, no. I hey, my, this platform is for all individuals from all spectrums and all the facets yeah, of I am usefulness a hoe after all. and and what? I'm a hoe. Remember when I went on the I went on the slut walk? I I too am a slut. That's what Amber Rose made me say. Amber Rose is your wife? Uh, nah, we had a kid together though. So your baby mama, as they call it. Listen, I don't like that terminology. You make me sound like some kind of miscreant. Twenty one for the kids, twenty one raise money. All right, twenty one. So, uh, what do you think about that? I mean, I think it's yeah. quite messed up it's not like the music companies or whoever holds the rights is losing money it's not like if any all streaming is purely promotion for the products and to say that they can't do it especially when these companies have their own streams and they don't really adhere to any dmca strike they they use Screw other up. people's content all the time straight up um what do you think 21 See, you know, your boy, your boy Biko, you know, he, he ran into some of this shit, you know, he got a, he got a notice about some Undertale music, you know, again, Undertale, that pixel shit he be playing, yeah, 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 he got, he got a couple of notices about that one, and you know, some other creators did too, it's kind of, it's kind of messed up, because, you know, not everybody has access to royalty free music and bullshit they can play on their stream that's not just straight up in the well, game. Is the problem really royalty free music? Or is the problem, I, I mean, the problems of music in the game? I mean, if you're going to play okay. Dark Souls, but you get DMCA striked because of the boss music, well, imagine playing Dark Souls on mute or Bloodborne on mute. It's trash. That doesn't. That's garbage. I mean, nobody wants to watch that. It's like that half the game is the music. The I mean, I'm telling you, man. Uh, I, think it, I think this is really. It doesn't do anything good for anyone. I know Amazon is also putting out their own like royalty free music app baloney thingamajig. Yeah. Yeah, I get they, that. They're supposed I know they to be putting that. out a library people can use. But you're right. The pro- the problem, even as an artist, straight up, I don't I don't I don't like to get too much in the way of people creating what it, they want. Did you create. say scraped up? Straight up. You make it fun the way I talk now. You dig? I don't like that, bro. I'm just waiting for the English accent to come out. Ah, uh, yeah. See, you the Republican. You the one. You the one calling me out of my action. Like, man, listen. I don't even know why I did this show, man. Y'all ain't paying me, man. Anyway, man. Listen. I feel yes, that 21. when you have a platform that's for something like that, something like playing games, like something like that, and you're supposed to be allowing people to do shit like that. You shouldn't be only nuts about using other people's music for the stuff that's already in there. Hey, I, I, music, the game wouldn't come with music if it wasn't supposed to be playing the music. If it, At that point, are you going to start copywriting the sounds from the game? Then what's even the point? What's the point of even doing any of this shit? I don't think it makes any sense. I feel like it's just another way to stop people from, I, I, from doing what they want to do because it doesn't even make any sense. What do you want everybody to do? Put soundtracks behind their games or mute the music like you said that shit don't even make no sense i don't even i don't even know about that 
Well, it's just weird because the the action basically is like we don't want streaming, <coughs> but a lot of games advertising to. I mean, you, you think about it. You don't have magazines like you used to anymore. Yeah. You don't see billboards or anything. Game stops are closing. Uh, like it's stuff like Twitter and YouTube. That's all niche, you know. Like you're gonna yeah. know to look for fucking Mortal Kombat stuff if you know it already. That's yeah. not good advertising. The best advertisement they have is the combination of all these things yeah. and the cut off that Twitch arm. I mean, Twitch is niche as well, but you don't... I mean, Very millions niche. of people go on there and then find something else 21, 21. that they didn't know about. And they follow these people who play hundreds of games a year and people buy from that and I, I think it's just uh counterintuitive anyway yeah there's, there's games people wouldn't even play if it wasn't for uh if it wasn't for like that what game that 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 ghost game everybody playing uh phasmophobia uh the the other one the, yeah the alien one uh uh sus no among us yeah yeah that one that one right, yeah right yeah it, so you you I know mean, I, I think this is counter counterintuitive i know I don't fuck with that. I don't know if it's counterintuitive. I think it, it's counterproductive for whatever they want. Round one. Anyway, that's, that's first the word. That's the first word. real story. That's the word. I know, man. Did you go to school, Savage? Nah, nah, bro. I dropped out. I ain't, I ain't had time for all that shit. I was, I was beating niggas up. I was dropping out of football. You ain't, you ain't never heard my song, No Heart. You ain't never. Ninth grade. I've heard your song. Yeah, and, you and from your, from your aura. I'm assuming when you say drop out, you mean high school, not college. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I dro- I dropped out of high right. school, bro. I ain't college. I ain't. I ain't at that point in my life. I ain't. I ain't y'all that. I'm slaughtered. All game. right. Well, still slaughtered. Well, game. here's the thing. We got we got a lot of Full PlayStation L, news, right? And we're gonna push all the PlayStation news into one little PlayStation sandwich. We got Xbox news. You know because. It's new console time. We probably just need to do an Xbox section, PlayStation section, yeah, Nintendo section, and then um, just have those, you know, dock it on the side. But let, let's go into Straight up. Uh, a goodie right now. Uh, we were just talking about this earlier. Marvel's Avengers content is on the way. Uh, so there's big update. Well, not big update. There was an update, added a new mission type, added, fixed a lot of uh, loot pools. Uh, fixed bugs gave people free money to buy costumes and stuff, and they gave us more of an update on the Screwed up. content layout and plan. Uh, the newest DLC is put, or the newest character, Kate Bishop, is pushed back till Who early November instead of late October. Kate Bishop is Hawkeye. The so Marvel did a thing where they. Uh, Ah uh, shit! They refresh. Ret- they retcon some shit. No, no, no. They just refreshed a lot of the uh, heroes. Reboot, so like, reboot. there was a, there was like a Teen Avengers, Young yeah. Avengers book, and one of the characters in there was a Hawkeye. She was called Hawkeye because at the time Hawkeye was Dawn, and oh, shit. the other, you know, that's crazy. Yeah, you know, all the other fuckers who call himself Hawkeye were also gone. So anyway, Kate Bishop. That's why we don't call her Hawkeye. She comes. Early ne- in November, and then uh, Hawkeye himself should actually come straight up a month or so after that. Uh, I I kind of want to talk about this because I'm starting to learn that watching personalities, content creators, we should call. I I don't want to say that because technically we're content creators. A lot of these people are just reactionaries. I just caught yeah, on to people like you ever oh, yeah. you, you ever heard of uh, what culture? They're a bunch of bullshit. They got what some gar- they got some garbage on their channel. And then when when you hear them talk about this game, and what people th- say say about the game, and then when you hear the people who actually play the game, whether it's on Reddit or other YouTube channels that cover the thing and all that stuff, it's very stark. So I mean, even the topics are are similar, but very very different. For example, the new update that just came out. If you look at the content creators who yeah. 
are the bigger ones who who just do the reactionary stuff. Who just there's a news article, they read it and look at. They basically read to you what it says and then say like, uh, you know, yay or nay, right? Yeah. When you listen to them, it sounds like, oh, they're messing up again. The DLC is pushed back. They put out an update that wasn't a big update, and people on PC are, are, people are leaving the game. Don't right? DLC get pushed back like all the time? Yeah, but that's not the point. But when you look at the people actually play the game and talking about the game and in the game, the update was generally positive. Some people wanted more, but it's positive. It fixed a ton of stuff. It yeah. added to the loot pool. It Straight made up. a new mission type. Especially for people at the end game that they can do, uh, and it added a new kind of structure with multiplayer. The pushing back of the DLC is not a big deal because it's only like one or two weeks. I don't think most people are too uh, upset about that. We have another update coming as well with extra raids. There's more communication going on, and I think generally it's more positive than it's been the whole lifespan of the game. Ain't they, ain't they giving everybody free th- shit too to like make up for? Yeah, how they gave the they gave free currencies and a lot of upgrade stuff, and I think they've done a decent job with that uh, update Straight upgrade up. thing. But you wouldn't hear that if you were listening to these people who actually aren't in the communities. It's really weird, and it makes me think like maybe how would I feel about stuff like. There, there. Are, I'm sure there are games I don't play because of things I've heard that I might actually Straight up. enjoy. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah. Maybe Rainbow Six Siege is a fun game. <laughs> maybe. Yeah. Uh, what, what's that? What's the name? What's that? Uh, what's that other game? Uh, the one with space. Maybe it is something Among, I Among might Us. like. Um, Among Us. Beca- well, no, but that's another thing. Everyone loves Among Us, right? Everyone's going to love CD Projekt Red Cyberpunk 2077. Even though 90% of the people talking about it will play it, beat it in a, uh, like a week or three days or two and days on stream. Shit again. And then never touch it again, but they'll make 10 videos about it. You know what I mean? I see a new cyberpunk then, video every day. I'm just I'm just chilling in my house. You know, I got I got to entertain myself. I turn on YouTube, watch the lame ass competition, and then you know I turn on I turn on the game part, and it's just cyberpunk, 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 and I don't even know it ain't even new information. It's just the same shit over and over. That game is too shiny. I was talking to MXGXPX about this. This game is way. Friend of the show, MXGXPX. Thanks for listening. Shout out. This up. game is way too shiny. It's always wet when they show the trailer. It's always wet, right? Right? Yeah, that's one of my lines on my new album, Straight Up. What? It's always wet? Straight Up. Can you rap a little bit for us? No. It's always wet in the game, right? I get it. Cyberpunk. That's a thing that means things to people. It's about what what does cyberpunk mean to people? Pipes, future, lights, neon, uh like bikes, uh laser guns, uh, augmentation, right? Um I get it. I see I, I know it's a hype machine. I, I'm sure other people feel the way I feel about this when like we're talking about Mortal Kombat or some shit and I'm talking about fucking you know Melinas and stuff yeah, like but yeah yeah anyway back to my point I I'm starting to really not like uh, a lot of the stuff I used to like on YouTube because I'm I'm figuring out that it is it's not just with news either. It's with games now. It's with comic books. It's with movies. The, the people just make videos because they need to make a video, and they don't. The time. I mean, they're literally people just sit at their desk all day, wait for something to pop up on Twitter, make a video about it, read to you on the screen the article, uh, I don't like this and shit. then say like, "I think that's." Uh, good, bad, 
<laughs> and then they <laughs> like the eighty five thousand views in and out. It's just ridiculous. I watched uh, a ten minute I, yeah. video the other day about two guys talking about how two K gonna have ads in it. Why the fuck was that video ten minutes long? Hey, uh, speaking of that, two K is it? No, nah, this isn't two K. That's not two K. That's two K. That's two K. Two K. Two K has See, ads in that. it. That's two K. Yeah, man. That's 2K. So uh, NBA 2K is going to have unskippable ads in it. It's great. Up. In the same way that UFC did where it's part of the presentation, like, ooh, commercial break now, and they show you an ad. I, I still think this is, like, the worst and dumbest thing, especially because Wait, these so you games can't, you sell can't a ton. skip the ad at all? It's they, just, you it's can't just skip it. You can't skip it. It's full price. Damn. Can't skip it. Uh, and they're also trying to milk you for money to buy these cards, to buy digital cards that won't be of any worth in eight months. And I think it's Trash. just ridiculous that they keep this in there. If they want, I think it makes sense to have ads in the game, but they shouldn't be real ads. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They no, shouldn't I, be, they should I don't be, fuck with that. Take the time to make fake or immersive or something adds or, like i get it because it does add to the experience of you're watching it on tv even when i play 2k i play 2k in the uh broadcast camera because i want to see it like i see nah, it on bro. tv i don't want to nah, see bro, it but you know at, like you know you know nobody like no commercial what happened when you when a commercial come on when you watching the game what you do? You hop on your phone. You don't even be watching that shit. Nobody watching the commercial, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But but they they do the whole thing with it. They have the panel of guys talking in between and a halftime. They do the interviews, and I get it. it's part of the immersion. Have commercials that are fake, skippable, maybe even joke commercials. But you can't put real ads in these games. Yeah, and it's trash, that, that's bro. like that's really it's trash. That's really trash. It's that's garbage, really bro. shitty. No, so you think they're gonna take this shit out? I heard, I heard UFC took these out. You think they're gonna take these out? Or this one? I think they will if enough people complain. But the thing is, enough people are also gonna buy the game. I was thinking about buying the two K, this two K, because it's next gen, it's shiny. Uh, you know, Mavericks went to the playoffs this year. I'm excited. Gang, gang. But with the ads, like, you you're kind of saying to me as a customer. My purchase isn't enough. Right, right. Right? Like, I'm paying you money for this game. I'm possibly paying you money, especially the average consumers, every single year. $60, $70 plus money for these cards. And then you're on top of that, you're telling me uh, we also need money from uh, Oculus. Right, right, yeah, yeah. You know, it's it's showing <laughs> to us throw at me bullshit. in the game. It's not even like free. It'd be different if they're a free version and they had ads. Okay, fine, I get it's it. A it's a full free. price game, no. bro. You already pay sixty no. bucks. So you you, you are, of course are gonna buy two K. How do you feel about the ads? Well, you know, I I I'm kind of mad because I only got so much time, bro. It ain't even about paying. It ain't even really about the money. It's about wasting my time, bro. I'm trying to play the game. I. Ain't, ain't load time supposed to be fast next generation too? They got time to show me a whole ad when the game's supposed that's to load a, yeah, fast. Yeah, that's the thing too. They're literally slowing down your game to show you an ad. It's not like they need to show this to cut time or give you something in between or this is an ad. They're cutting down the time for you playing the game Damn. or increasing the time of you doing nothing and having to wait between game time. Man, nah, this, that's that's pretty fucked. That's that's fucked up, bro. See, that's I don't like that, cause, cause see, I thought I was getting a new. I I already got like I, I got two PS5s in the crib right now. They pretty fast, but you know, the reason I got them is because oh, they, right? they 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 faster, you know, and and that's kind of that's kind of messed up, man. I don't want to be looking at no dude with a what is that? What is that shit on his head? That's a woman, by the way. I can't tell, nigga. This is this is. I don't assume nobody gender twenty one for the kids. Anyway, I don't I don't know what this shit is. I just don't need this in my face. I don't need all this, bro. I just want to play basketball. I I I'll cop it, but probably just because I'm just gonna have it delivered to my house anyway. But you know, you know how it go. 
Yeah, I know how I go, man. I know how round I go. Round hey, 21, really, why don't you drop one rap? For us, all right. Here we go. Here we go. I'm gonna say, damn, son, son, where'd, where'd you, you find, find this? this? Come on, give me some. All right, you about to get copyright stricken, young savage. Why you trapping so hard? Uh huh. Why these niggas capping so hard? Yeah. Why you got a twelve car garage? Well, why you huh? pulling all these rappers garage? Cause these niggas I don't think pussy that's how and they, I'm garage. Twenty. I turn some fucking soft into garage. I grew up in the streets without garage. I turned that fucking soft into garage. Okay, up, thank you. That That's enough. If, what's the name of that song? No Garage. Uh, uh, from where you're from, you should say Garage, though. Hey, I don't appreciate that British shit, bro. I ain't, I ain't, I don't be toting no scraps with no fucking gunpowder, bro. I don't like all that. Uh, <clears throat> I, like the, I like the knife on the gun, though. I like the knife on the gun. You know what that's called, Savage? I know you dropped out of school. Well, you know what that knife it's on the gun is called? It's a bayonet, you, 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 you assumer. Rock Band 4. Uh, apparently, people care about this shit still. Look, I love me some Guitar Hero. Hey, when bro, I have Guitar can you, can, you, can you introduce the topic first? I don't even know what the fuck you're talking about, bro. I'm, hey, check it out. How about you open your ears and listen? All right. <laughs> Rock Band Film. I'm going to find you next. All right. Rock Band 4. All right. Rock Band 4 is going to be forward compatible with uh, PlayStation 5 and Xbox, including the peripherals. You'll still be able to use the guitar, the bass, the drums, uh, the cool, microphone. Cool. My kid's going to like that. My kid's going to like that, bro. That's cool. Oh, no. It's great. I have no problem with it. I don't know why it's news. I saw this pop up a lot. Like, people were super excited and happy. But, um, yeah, it's it's forward compatible. It's going to work. Um, I don't know how many people are playing Rock Band 4, though. It's great up. I, I, you think they're going to make another one of these, though? Because I, 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 no, I kind of like okay. these games. I like the Guitar Hero Rock Band. A lot of people like these games, you know but saying. the reason they're gone is the same reason that they were so popular. The reason Rock Band is gone and done is because, and not just Rock Band, uh, Guitar Hero as well. The opportunity had been seen by Straight up. two companies only. The Guitar Hero people did turn it on, first. Guitar, the Rock Band guitar. people followed. And they banged out like 30 goddamn <laughs> music games in four or five years. Right? Five years. Yeah. Yeah. It was, I mean, they banged them out because they knew at some point those licensing fees are going to go up. There's always new music you can add. And if they were to put out one game every two years or three years, that fad, they would have missed out on so much money. So that's why you got Rock Band Beatles and Rock Band 1 and Rock Band 2 and Guitar yeah, Hero yeah, 1. Yeah, bro. There was like 20 of them. And they all came out and DJ Hero and DJ them. Hero 2. And they're all fun and come out and they add more music. Because they know that once the, the record companies get on and think, oh, there's a lot of money to be made here. We can charge more for these licensing fees. It's over. They know that the pool of music you can use is infinite. Right? So they pop, pop, yeah. pop, 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 pop them out. Yeah. The, the supply was high. And then that cost to actually get that music and have that music and have people play it and buy it went way up and skyrocketed because of the value. Yeah. And now these companies, Harmonix, whoever else makes the games, straight up, they're not doing, they're not paying that. They got the money from it. They, they, they saw the opportunity. They took it. It's not gonna happen again. Twenty one. Not 21. gonna happen again. It's too expensive. Right. And they right. did right. I mean, it, people were complaining when they're coming out. It's a great business decision to release all those games so often. You so because, so you don't think it's ever gonna come back. You don't think there ain't, there ain't no chance. 
No, especially with how the DMCA stuff is happening with YouTube and Twitch and Twitter as well. Like, you can't oh, post damn. a meme if it's got the wrong music and you have too many people following you. No, 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 no. Un- unless, like, we get a whole bunch of younger people into the, you know, the government and they change these copyright laws government. and change these things. Go vote. It's not going to... It's not going to change because the companies have all the power with this stuff. They can screw you over. They can make you pay a ton of money for something. But I, I guarantee you they they profit off of you more than you do them using screw their music. A hundred percent. Damn. So so I don't know. Yeah, we, maybe we don't need any more of those games right now. I don't know. I, it, I'd love to have one. We're not going to get one. And if I'm wrong, if I'm wrong, I'll eat an orange. Okay? Oh, he's going to eat an orange, y'all. I don't, I don't know about that one, man. That's a lot. Uh, New Mortal Kombat 11 Ultimate Gameplay trailer shows off Rain. And today we have the Rain Combat cast as well. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that shit look kind of cold. Yeah, Rain looks great. Looks good. Uh, I wish that... Uh, I don't know. I think people don't value these games the way they should. I know we, we you know, we pay money what, for them. More, more, more Combat 11 specifically? Yeah. No, no, not just this game, but all of these games that kind of try to have these longer lifespans and then people just uh, especially the community that they're for take pot shots at it because like it's literally great. everyone's at home, there's nothing else to do. I'm talking about your Monster Hunters. I'm talking about your Mortal Kombat's and all this stuff. When I was a kid, not even a kid, 10 years ago, this just stay, this just stay 10 years ago. You get a game, you buy it, and it's most likely just over. Yeah. No new content. There's no update. There's you, Maybe you got multiplayer and you just do that for a lot. Is that your cat, Savage? No, it's not my cat. This cat was here when I got in this room. I don't know who he is. What's his name? I don't know. He liked to be called uh, Chopper. Does you know, Chopper call, have anything know, to say? You know, you know, I call my Chopper kid, Chopper. All right. Anyway, so I Mortal Kombat. Because uh, it hates niggas. Mortal Kombat, Combat Pack 2, pre-order is available now. You can go pre-order it when starting it yesterday. It's out November 17th. I think same day as the consoles, actually. So you can pre-order it now. You get a free upgrade to the PlayStation 5. All your stuff carries Screw over. Up. I think except story progress, you still get the rewards. Progress doesn't carry over. And uh, multi- like online record doesn't carry over, but you still keep your Sad. rewards from your rec- from your own. Like it. Yeah, yeah. That bumps people out. I don't give a shit. Uh, but yeah, Rain looks cool. Screw I think up. his moves are moving uh very wet lots of water i like the portal stuff he looks i guess more combo potential than most other characters so i will be jumping back into the game it's hard for me to play because uh if you don't know the guy you tied up javal he is a he he just absolutely hates losing and he loses no i don't don't like to lose either but i heard i heard you also be using the same two characters and he don't like that shit because here's the thing, I'm gonna let you know because I never want to hurt the guy's feelings, all right? Oh, okay. okay. If I used more characters, is he'd key. feel worse because I'd smack them cheeks with more characters. Man, if you I sound just like the pussy ass, ass rappers cheeks. that be dissing people. I don't want to hear none of that. I know hey, I tired bro up, good. but I don't want I don't want you talking none of that trash, bro. Uh huh. Look, twenty one, twenty one. Look, the kid's not gonna beat me, all right? He's not gonna beat me, all right. That's that's how it works. I don't know. He didn't beat me either, so. And that was our news. Um, So look, we got a a truckload of PlayStation topics here to uh, to go into. So that's you know that's what we're gonna do. Uh, Let's straight up. Start with the uh, UI. All right, we got a new PlayStation oh, UI yeah, video. Yeah, yeah. All the stuff you can do in the game, switching between games, joining. Uh, did you see this twenty one? Yeah, yeah, I saw that. I saw that in the Xbox one last week. Now nah, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah. You mm-hmm. can 
you can start a bunch of games and then switch in between them, and it shows you trophy progress. And the share screen is a lot easier. You pull up the share screen, and it take it takes screenshots in 4K, and it saves all your videos yep. in 4K too. That's kind of that's kind of lit. I like that. Yeah, um, I I it, it looked all right. I don't need as much as with the showing. What I need to be able to do is make a party, get friends in there. Uh, finish, <laughs> play the game, switch game. That's it. Uh, but you know, it's it'd be interesting to see a new UI. It will be interesting to see a new UI. Uh, I'm not like super excited for it, but it's nice it's to dope. see it. Uh, I know a lot of people are complaining also this week about the new update with parties. Yeah, you see what, that? what 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 the, was it the 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 report and audio thing? Uh, what is it? Well, there's the recording audio part, which I I've, I've heard a little bit about, but I think most people don't care because it, there's, there's only a slight change, huh? I think people are paranoid. People thought that PlayStation is gonna be listening in on them. Okay, so let's start with the voice one. So there was an update added to the PS4, which is in preparation to connect with the PlayStation Five. So the same kind of uh, structure will be there. When you are in voice chat or in party chat with people, they will be able to record you, which is not very different from now, right? If I were to go on my PlayStation yeah. and hit record, I can record the party. Uh, you do have settings that allow you to, I guess, not be recorded or it asks you if you want to. I don't, I forgot how it works. But with the new PlayStation 5, um, part of the reporting system is also reporting people in voice chat who do or say things that you find uh, reportable so if you so people will be able to take a voice recording from a party chat and submit it to report and a lot of people are worried about privacy and all that stuff sony yeah. has said that they they are not recording the data the data is not being held on their servers or anything it's the people you're in a party with yeah recording yeah uh i do kind of th- it's kind of like a two-sided thing. Like I don't want to be recorded, but I, you know I don't care that much about. How often that do you anyway. think somebody will record you anyway? Well, the thing is, exactly the recording part is supposed to be to report someone for like calling you a, a green negro or something. Damn, that's savage. But if I'm I'm only in parties with my friends and I don't think I'll ever report my friends nor will they report me for saying something. And even if I were in a party with someone else, right? Yeah. I don't know why anyone in a party would report you for something Yeah. Like and, why and would unless you it's one anything? of those parties with a bunch of randos, which I know a lot of kids like do that stupid shit. So Yeah, a lot of kids have parties with a bunch of randos, friends of friends of friends of friends and just people you meet in the in the jungle. But then, like, if the worry is that you'll get recorded and they'll report you, if you didn't say anything, it'll it'll be yeah, a non. They said people issue. gonna be reviewing each clip. Right, but I guess it's it's in response to. So if you don't know, uh, I, I'm pr- and I'm pretty sure reporting happens a lot more on Xbox than it does on PlayStation. Sorry. I remember when I had an Xbox. There's a lot of reporting being done on me. I was reporting other people. It is report up. wars. All right. You can, re- if you just don't like someone, you can report them for saying something to you in chat. And if enough reports come in, at least on Xbox, I don't know if Sony's the same, but if enough reports come in, you will get, you get a suspension. Yeah, yeah, you'll get auto banned. You'll get suspended. Uh, you X- can't use- Xbox the I same say- thing. People back in the day, I remember I used to play uh, Call of Duty Black Ops, Black Cops, and uh, yo, they used to they used to report my account all the time. If you met- yeah, yeah, Carl Weathers, and and whenever you report somebody enough, it auto bans the account on Xbox too. It does the same thing. Yeah, so it do- it yeah, does that right. on PlayStation it- as well. Okay, so it's on both. And so I was banned before, and I had to call in and say, like, hey, what the N- fuck? Niggas is hating on and me because I was whooping their ass, yeah. Right, you'll just beat someone in a game bad enough, and they could report you. So now that I feel like the voice thing is more of a deterrent for reports than it is an encouragement to record people 
to you know what I mean? But I understand people's concerns. I don't I'm not too concerned because I'm not gonna be with people who are gonna report me or record me to you know Kanye West me or something like yeah. that. So I don't know. We'll see. But the other thing is yeah. which is uh currently an issue not a future issue is the party system a lot of people apparently because of the update parties are made as groups now and so to have a party you need to have someone in a party you need a group. yeah that makes sense and, and, well no it doesn't i mean a party apparently oh. so you can't just open a party you have to start a party with a group so if i want to have a party and open a party i can't just open a party and be in there by myself I mean, I'm sure you can. There's a way to do it. But when you go to open parties, you got to create a group or use a group. So like this past weekend, the group was, well, we have a secret group. I'm not telling anybody who's in the group or what the group's name is. I don't want a group found. But we have a group. And if I make a party for that group, all people in that group, whether they're online or not, are actually part of the group and can join the party. And everyone else can't. But you can add people who are not in the group to the party. I I, I did it over the weekend. I'm not really sure what people are complaining about. It that don't much. sound like it's, much change. It yeah, that's the thing. It's it's I guess it is an extra button press if you wanted to just have a party by yourself or have a party with randoms. But no, it really isn't because you just go to the person's that's name and you trash. click party and then it works. So I don't know. Yeah, I, no, I'm not people sure. like to complain about a lot. A lot. Yeah, that's true, Savage. That's Yo, true. I heard, I heard some people gonna get their PlayStation shit. Not, not the actual PlayStation, but the controllers and the the camera and the headset. They they coming out. They coming out early. I heard they coming there uh, October thirtieth. People get right, them. so people are getting their PlayStation Five accessories. They are being shipped out, and they will be delivered soon. Uh, and people, I guess, are excited to not be able to use a goddamn controller. Nah, and, nah, and bro, that, that's not true. That's not true. See, see, I, I checked Homeboy email. He getting the camera and he getting the headset. But I heard the headset works on both, so he gonna test that out. It may not got the three D audio, but he gonna test it out. He gonna get both of them. He may not be able to use the 3D camera, but he gonna try to use the headset. I, but I had a theory about why they did this. They did this because they know they gotta ship the consoles too, so they gonna get this out of the way a week or two early, so that when the consoles ship, it ain't as much shit to put out. I mean, I think it's smart because you don't want people to have consoles without having the number of controllers they want or whatever. I think it's fine. Um, Straight up. I think it, it, it is early, but I guess early is better than late, right? Um, excuse me. Uh, sadly, I still don't have a PlayStation 5 pre-ordered, but good thing is uh, Sony um, promoted the uh, Black Lives what? Matter uh, game that they have. It, they've had it. I don't even think it was released on when they tweeted about it. They but released they had that it. like a long time ago. It's not new. I'm pretty sure sh- because I, I saw a tweet about it days before. Like, oh, uh, it, there's a there's a Twitter. What was it called? Profile account? I don't know. Account. There's a Twitter account that basically just tells you all the free PlayStation themes that are out. Yeah. And so I saw that tweeted on there, and then. A day or two later, PlayStation it's tweeted about it because you know it's free, and uh, a lot of people are angry because you know black, black people a uh, far left democratic terrorists, and so uh, <laughs> a lot of people canceled their play. Well, <laughs> a lot of people said they were canceling the they PlayStation. Cancel, they didn't cancel shit. First of all, they probably didn't have a pre order in the first place. Uh, second of all, they might just be talking shit. And third of all, good for me because I might be able to get one now. Yeah. If, yeah. Uh, if they're going back into the wild. Also, it might be too late to cancel something like that. Right Imagine now, right? going out of your way to be mad at a theme about a theme you ain't even got to download. It's just there. 
Yeah, that's weird. Like, it's just on the store. And there are lots of things on the store. They said the same thing when the, they had the, the LGBT theme. I see a bunch of people in the comments like, why you support mental illness? Like, people saying just mean shit in the comments. Uh, yeah, it's just dumb <laughs> shit. Yeah, I like I get why PlayStation promotes it because it'll get lots of downloads. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's it's Straight just gonna it's same with the gay thing. Um, I don't know. Uh, it, I mean, I guess people are upset about it. I don't see. I think it's what dumb. The big I I, I did. Yeah, I, I don't know about that one, Chief. People, I mean, even, people like, also mad at the game it, with women in it. So I don't know, man. Even if you don't like the uh black lives matter thing right maybe a staunch maybe, concern maybe, maybe you're just racist you you are you are born and you came out the vagina with a a cop's hat and uh you know your first and second wife are both guns whatever i and don't you, and you were probably 30 percent more likely to beat them get it because cops right uh 21 21 <laughs> I just, I think it's like, I think it's really funny. Those same people will talk about how everyone else is a snowflake and so sensitive. Everything's too political. And, and everything's too political. And then the moment something, uh, you know, pulls on their nose hair a little too hard or even just exists. It's not even like. It's, it's, it's just big, there, bro. Just like, hey, yo, like, just close the fucking browser, bro. You ain't even got to take it out of you. They ain't advertising on the front page like they do PlayStation now. You ain't even got to go. You got to go look for the shit. Well, you know, I I mean, it, it happens everywhere, right? All spectrums, both sides, whatever. But um, I just think it's, it's always yeah. silly. like. It's not like it's a. I don't know. Maybe people don't see it that way. Maybe people do see it. It's something directly attacking them, like Nazis or something like that. But yeah, that that's that's what we call uh, uh, stupidity. Twenty one. You don't seem to be very rapper like. You just seem like a a guy from Taco Bell. Yo, yo, I, I just be chilling. You know what I mean? I don't know what. I don't really play in around with you niggas like that, man. I'm just. I'm here to chill. I ain't get here to you know rap on camera. I ain't tap dancing for no mass. I ain't doing none of that. I ain't doing none of that. I ain't, that ain't me. You know what? That ain't me. Why don't you just go ahead and drop another rap for us though? Like just a freestyle. Do you want music? No music? 21, 21. Oh, are you starting? 21, okay. go to the stove. Here we go. 21, Super shit. 21, shoot you and 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 shoot you some more. Straight up, savage on shit. Steal all your cabbage and shit. Bring all that cabbage and shit. 21, 21. That's all you get. <laughs> Wait, okay. Can we dissect sec that a little bit? Can, so can you go over that first line again? I don't remember the first line. It was off the dome. Oh, that was a freestyle, huh? Straight I heard you talk about cabbage. Yeah, you ain't you don't know slang. I burn I burn your oh, cabbage. What's cabbage slang for? It's money. You ain't getting no money like that, so I guess you don't know. Okay. All right. Well, thank thank you for that. Savage. Damn, Damn son. son. Where'd, where'd you, where'd you find, find this? Hey, yo, I heard I heard the uh you can't buy no more PSP games, bro. I like them PSP games. Right. So PlayStation, more PlayStation news. PlayStation is not a. I mean, PlayStation Vita and PSP. No, not Vita. PSP uh, games are won't be available. And, v and Vita. And Vita. That sucks. Uh, because I have lots of places. I have probably like three hundred. PSP and Vita games. No, uh, no, no. But look, look, the games are still there. You just gotta go on the store on the actual device. You can't do it through the online anymore. You can't go on your computer. So the store is still there. You just can't do nothing with it unless you go and like unless you physically pick up could pick up your Vita. Which, by the way, if you ain't opened the Vita store recently, they ain't updated that hoe in like five or six years. Yeah, um, I know. But ho okay, so on my PlayStation Five, I'll be able to open the store and then go re-download 
Tales of Dragoon. No. Legend of the Dragoon. No, you need to go. No, to get to get any PSP games, PS Vita games, and PS3 games, you got to go on that system to get them. But I can play Legend of Dragoon on my PlayStation Four, so I'm not gonna be able to play it on the five. You know what? That's a good point. So I think Legends of Dragoon is different. It says PlayStation 3 games. So that's implying, I think that's if you were trying to play like a PlayStation 3 exclusive game like Killzone 2. And you were trying to play that on your PS5. No, nah, you'd have to go download it on your PS3 and play it on your PS3. I don't think it counts for PS1 classics and things like that. So that's, you got to go to the store directly uh, from the device. It's really stupid. Well, that's going to remove a lot of the re, like the backwards compatibility they talk about. Because on my PlayStation 4, I have like my favorite classic games, Final Straight up. Straight up. Straight up. Straight up. Straight up. that games I can play on my PlayStation 4 I can play on my right. 5 that's a large amount of games that you cannot play no 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 but, so so yeah so I don't think the 5 is going to play PS3 games regardless because the PS4 can't play PS3 games n- no but the PlayStation 4 can play PSP and Vita games no it cannot I can show you right now on my console what, PS, what, P, what PSP games you played on your PS4? I'd have to look and see, but they're there. Nah, bro, I don't. I don't know about that one, Chief. I'm pretty sure it's a God of well, War. Well, then, well, then, well, then. No, I don't think that that. I, I don't think you're right about that one. But, but anyway, it, well good. then, well then, I think you'd still be able to go on your console and go buy it. Then, if you can play it on that console, it's saying. The the news the news thing was saying that you cannot do it online on a browser, not on the console itself. It is talking about the browser store. We will see, because nigga, we'll see. I'm reading the story we'll right now. <laughs> I, I'm reading it too, bro. But my game is a PlayStation One game. No, no, we'll see. Uh, also, PT Konami confirmed PT will not coming. be available for the PlayStation Five. But that doesn't mean Duh. necessarily you won't be able to put it on the 5 because the PlayStation 5 will have Ethernet um, transferable data between 4 and 5. So you may be able to move PT from the 4 to the 5 through cable. I think that'd be nice. I If that's the case, you could go from one copy of PT to two copies of PT. Oh, ah, okay. That's kind of cool. That's I like that. I like that. If it's the case, but if we don't work. know. If it yeah. works. We'll see if it works. Yeah, right. All right. Yeah. All right. And Konami must have also been getting a lot of... For them to even talk about PT, right? They must be getting a lot of, like, letters or Straight Twitter up. emojis or something. Yeah. So, yeah, that, that's news. I mean, bad news, but news. Uh, What else we got with... PlayStation today. I, th- I think that's all the PlayStation shit. I ain't seen nothing else. Oh wait, the UI they gonna have a spoiler warning. So if somebody takes a screenshot from a game you have blocked or it has a spoiler in it, it won't show it to you unless you ask for it. Ain't that something? Ain't that something? All right, all right. Well, hey, I think uh, you know, 
We're getting closer and closer. I hope I get a pre-order. Uh, I hope I get to... I'll send you one, bro. Oh, you got money like that, Savage? Nah, just give me your address. I'll come through real quick. and uh, So you can tie much... me up, too, and do bad raps. You say my rap's bad? I'm not saying your raps are bad, but you did give us... You didn't even get like, a bar. You gave us something like... da da ba da da ba da 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 but uh, but uh, but uh, though, oh, that's what kind of what you did. All right, you know what? Man, I ain't got to be in this fucking show, bro. You you disrespectful in this bitch. I don't even know, man. Listen, Charlemagne the God ain't even disrespectful like this. This this is this is a whole other you know level. What? Let's see. The fuck. Um. What How about, doing? let me give you a beat, all right? And let's see if 21 can rap to the beat. Nah, bro, you trying to get me to do free entertainment, bro. I ain't trying to do all that. No, 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 no. I'll pay you. How much you want? Uh, it's at least it's at least five racks. Okay, uh, how much you want for? How much, how much you want Five racks for? a bar. 12, 12 seconds of rap. 12 seconds. That's $1,000 a second. That's $12,000. <laughs> 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 really? Twelve thousand dollars. That's the price, nigga. What you gonna say? All right, let's do it. Are you ready? Yeah, yeah, turn my headphones up. That's ass, bro. I ain't rapping to that. What is it what is this eighties gay club music? Bruh, you I can't even hear the beat. It's in and out. It's just a bunch of, bunch of scram scrambled noise. I can't even hear it. All right, twenty one. I I'm starting to think, uh, you're a poser. I ain't no fucking poser, Xbox. bro. You just ain't paying me uh, for raps. Um, raps. Twenty one. Phil Spencer's talking about the the buying of Bethesda and and the future of Bethesda titles. He says that they do plan to make their seven point five billy back. It's a lot of money. It's but racks. it wasn't done to take games away from another player base, is what he says. Uh and that's what they've been saying. Uh until Right. Until he says they're gonna. They're thinking about where people are going to be playing, and a number of devices, and Game Pass, and all that stuff. And he says I don't have to ship those games on any other platform other than the platforms that we support in order to kind of deal work for us, whatever that means. He, so yeah, basically, yeah, yeah he's re reneging on. That's why. Here's the thing. When they first did it, that's why they didn't say, no, it's coming out everywhere. Because it's not. And it it's wasn't. Not. It was never the plan. I do think some of those games will come out in other places. But Some of them. Hey, you're going to have Doom on Xbox only. You're going to have your horror games on uh, with Evil Within. Because why not, first of all? They own it. Why wouldn't you? Yeah, you probably would make more money if you put it out in more places. It's great up. But then I I have a feeling Xbox is learning from their mistakes. Why would you make the same mistake you made last generation where you have nothing exclusive to you, where you can play everything everywhere? At the if mm -hmm. and if you take it to the next level to make it even worse, where you can play everything everywhere, including the competitors machine. I mean, they they'd really be dumb for it. It, it sucks, yeah, all, all but, them jokes you know. about Xbox not having games, they might as well just pull this out their ass and be like, "Yo, we got enough games now." Right, and I don't know how much this will help them as far as selling Xboxes, because to me, at the end of the day, people aren't. Like when you look at these games, right? They, they straight up, you know, Doom, Fallout, Elder Scrolls. They, straight they, up. it's a wide audience of people. They're very yeah. big games when they come out and stuff. Uh, but 
I don't know if I'd buy an Xbox for this, especially because I could not buy an Xbox and still play these games on my on, P- on your PC. Your PC is an Xbox, basically. Um, so smaller than an Xbox. Know. But if if you're a person without a computer and you want to play these games, yeah, maybe you'll definitely buy an Xbox to uh, experience a little more. But that's the. Oh, no, Mom. Well, yeah, I'm gonna stick to surprise. PlayStation. I don't know why people are acting like it's a surprise or being upset at it. The only reason they didn't say it before was because it's bad press. It, if, like, it's same thing with Sony Spider Man stuff. If they had said we bought Bethesda, Xbox Bethesda, everybody would be saying, oh, well, also, Xbox is seen as the underdog now because they even sold though they're, even though they're Microsoft. Right, exactly. It's ridiculous. Anyway, um, but people would say, oh, this is so anti-consumer. Blah, blah, blah. We n- how can you not expect it to be this? I was hoping it wouldn't. 20, I was 20. even leaning toward, you know, maybe it's smarter for them not to. But come on. Why even take the risk? It's not, it's not an impossibility. It, right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But, you know, when, the, when I, I just want to see how PlayStation responds. Because I have a feeling PlayStation was leaning a lot toward letting stuff be on PC. But now right. that Xbox has this Bethesda catalog and they've been buying up studios, maybe PlayStation will feel like if they were also on PC, that would actually hurt them because they, it would you know lessen your exclusivity. Buy more studios, get more exclusives only on this box. We'll see. But I am, you know what? I really do want another Vita or something. Oh, yeah. I can't, can't tell you how much. Don't It'd be great Vita. to have a Vita with like PS4 graphics. That'd be cool. True that. Well, hey. Um, I like that. I don't know why I played that. I'm sorry. Savage, it's been, it's been great having you on the show. Uh, you're up. a little low energy. It's great up. Nah, man. I don't appreciate that, man. I give all my, I give my all. You want me to get this other dude back in here? I don't, I don't want to do this no more, man. Does he want to come in here? Me. I can go get him. I mean, I'm sure he wants out the ropes, but I mean, if you say no, that's fine. I can leave him there. No, man, you're fine. You're fine. Okay, yeah. okay. We're happy to have you on the show. Uh, we had a guest last week as well, uh, Mr. Commander Cobra. Yeah, Hitler Commander. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's Cobra Commander. Commander. Yeah. Yeah, a good friend of mine came to the show. Thanks for spotting me. Uh, I was I was uh, incapacitated at the time. Well, I wasn't uh, yeah, he got you too. Okay, okay, I see. No, 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 no. Like we over. Yeah. We're, we're uh, as as my old vegetarian friend who used to eat lots of meat used to say, we're bum buddies. You know, we're we're good. Uh, but thanks for being on the show. Uh, 21. No problem. No problem. Hopefully next time we'll get some some more raps out of you. Nah, you bro. Rapper? Like, I did expect more raps out 21 of 21 got a gun. 21 gonna shoot for some fun. 21 ain't done. To 21 done. Cause 21 ain't 21. To 21 got the 21. What's it? Okay, thank you. Uh, this has been the, another episode. Episode Straight 63. Up. October 20th of the Super Chevy Brothers podcast. I am Chavar, and we were uh, blessed with uh, 21 Savage today. Please uh, don't do drugs. Make sure that you listen to your parents uh, and go play Ghost of Tsushima new mode. It's super fun. Thanks for listening. We'll see you next time. I'm just stunting on my ex, bitch. I'm just flexing on my ex, bitch. <laughs>